Hey guys, welcome to the Easy Travel Guide. These are some of the best spots in the city of Glasgow. Oxen Finch. These guys do a tapas style concept with great wine and cocktail pairings, and they do it seriously well. You can play it safe with classics like chorizo and smoked haddock, or you can get adventurous. And trust me, it always pays off. If you fancy something with a bit more spice, check out Kapow, offering up a taste of Southeast Asia in the heart of Glasgow. These guys have some of the best seafood in the city, and this green curry of lamb shoulder is an absolute game changer. Make sure you check them out. Bread meets bread. Their mantra is big drinks, even bigger burgers. If you're looking to satisfy those late night cravings, look no further. With a varied meat and plant-based menu, these guys are guaranteed to have something for everyone. Laboratorio Espresso. This cool and cozy cafe in the city center offers up amazing coffee and baked treats. All of their beans are single source and the baristas are more than happy to talk you through what you're tasting. Whether it's a nice latte or just a simple espresso, these guys do it best. The Scotia. With a great atmosphere and friendly staff, it's no wonder this has remained a local favorite for hundreds of years. With a great selection of local breweries on tap, this spot is also known for hosting some amazing live acts all year round. You won't want to miss this. How about some cocktails? This is Gin 71 in Merchant City. With a gorgeous interior and huge selection of drinks, this is the perfect spot for a cocktail date. Just make sure you try their espresso martini with a chocolate orange twist. The Botanic Gardens in Glasgow's West End. This place is absolutely stunning, with two iconic glass houses filled with hundreds of exotic plants to get lost in. Surrounded by trendy cafes and restaurants, the gardens make for a perfect day out. And the best part is, they're absolutely free. The Glasgow Science Centre. Now this is one of the coolest places in the city. It's absolutely huge, with enough fun, interactive exhibits for days. When you go, don't forget to see what's on at the planetarium. This one's definitely not to be missed. 